is giving me Shirley Temple, <laughs> and that's not what I want to get. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. So happy Sunday. You know, I've been starting off my vlogs on a Sunday as of lately. Um, today, I woke up. I did not wake up on the best side of the bed because i started my period basically i felt like a big ass whale when i woke up you know he feels so bloated and heavy and uh i had like the worst cramps so it's like super late in the afternoon right now it's like one o'clock just now getting up because i got up went back to sleep try to sleep it away because i was in so much pain this morning but i still need to get my life together i need to start off by cleaning my house because it's not like i never get let my house get od dirty but it's like messy and I need to deep clean my bathroom and stuff. Excuse me. And what else am I gonna do? I'm gonna go to brunch. Yeah, I'm not gonna be out for a long today though. But I wanna come home and cook and like juice to prepare for the week. Sorry, my energy is like super low right now. I'm just tired and just, ugh. I mean, I'm starting to feel better because I took some medicine. Girl, I Tylenol it. Up. okay relieve this stress and this pain and from me right now but yeah so let's just before we get into that actually make sure you like and you subscribe okay i'm like i'm like breaking out because i started my period my hair look crazy girl whatever let's just start cleaning because i'm a trooper and it, it's just it's crazy to me that as women well, we're going through literally pain. We still have to do life. Work, take care of kids, do this, this, that, and the third, clean. Tragic, truly tragic. Me on no time, I ain't late. Uh, they run about my name, bait, bait. Sit back and roll all way. Hey, smoking that shit to the face. Hey, I call a cool different race. I see shit on the car, hit the gate. Hey, see, you know, it's not with the day. Uh, I'm gonna be coming at eight. Hey, spin back in the main way. Hey, I'm starting off in the best lane. Hey, smoke all back to the brain. Hey, sliding that bend and move, same, same. done cleaning i'm washing some clothes i'm washing my dishes so there's like some laundry and i need to put the dishes back up whenever i get home but that took so much energy out of me but i'm gonna start getting ready for brunch now it's two o'clock well it's not really brunch girl you know what i'm talking about just go out i'm gonna go get some food first and then go to bell station i've never heard of it I don't know, I looked it up on IG. I don't know if I'm gonna be feeling it, but 
we gonna try so let me get ready so she's ready i need to fix my hair because i need to brush this part out but i'm like letting it set just for a little bit but i want to show you guys my outfit so zara the two piece the shoes are from revolve Kogaya. i'm kind of getting vacay vibes but like i'm not going on a vacation anytime soon and i want to wear this outfit before the summer's over okay so i don't know if i'm gonna record when i'm out we'll see but if i don't i do i don't <laughs> if i do i do okay okay I'm in a rush right now because I have, y'all, I have so much shit. I have so much shit to do today. So I'm going on like a last minute trip to Vegas tomorrow from Thursday to Sunday. So of course I need to do all my prepping today. My hair looks crazy because why? I'm about to go get it done. Um, I'm about to go get my hair blown out and cut. As you guys know, my ends was looking crazy when I straightened it myself. So that's what I'm about to do. And I have to go to the mall today. I have to get my nails done. I have to get my lashes done. Like, girl, there's a hell of shit I have to do today. And I'm like in a rush right now because I need to go to my hair appointment. And I'm like, fuck. It's 20 minutes away. And I have literally 20 minutes to spare. But you know, you gotta find parking. I don't know what it's gonna be like. I just wanted to update you guys on what the hell. I was doing before I just showed up at the hair salon. So I will see you guys there. Yeah. Y'all just got done with my hair. I, I know, I know. I did not record anything because I was handling doctor's appointments, um, stuff for YouTube. Like, girl, I was doing so much and there was multiple people in there because she has everybody in like rotation. It was just way too much going on for me to set up my damn camera and show you guys. So I went to the hair whiz on Instagram. So D A W oh well, D A hair W H I Z. I think I'll link her down below. But I got long layers, y'all. She killed it. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, by the time you guys see this, I'll have a TikTok posted, and you'll see a segment of how much hair she cut off my damn head. I was nervous. I'm not even gonna lie. I was like, oh my, because look how short this piece is and imagine it used to be down here. Girl, so I'm sitting here tripping, like, oh my God, I'm gonna be fucking bald headed, like I'm not gonna have no hair. And I'm so happy that I decided to get layers because it just adds so much body and just a volume to your hair. I don't know, like the all length, the all one length is like a look, but I was just like, let me just jazz it up a little bit. Cause every time I do like, you know, my curls and stuff at home. I'm like, bro, it's not giving me the body that I want. And now I look like a brand new bitch, okay? I think layers is my new ting for the rest of my life. <laughs> All right. Oh, also, yeah, chaos happened. So I got into my car, you guys know, in my last vlog, I was supposed to get my battery replaced, but I didn't feel like being an adult and doing that that day. So guess what happened? My car didn't start this morning. So like my batteries all the way dead like i need a new battery so i had to uber here um when i got in my uber the lady took the wrong exit and i know she took the wrong exit because when she rerouted to actually go the correct way it was the it was going the total opposite direction and when i confronted her about it, i'm like hey i'm in a rush clearly i was already in a rush then i had to wait for an uber you know all that chaos um she was like oh uh, the exits are closed. Bitch, ain't no exit closed. You took the wrong one. Girl, you didn't take the motherfucking exit for it to be closed. Like, what are you talking about? Girl, I gave her a one star. Like, I don't care, because don't try to finesse me like I'm dumb. I have the route on my phone, you know? I'm about to get some food real quick. There's this state fair kitchen and bar. Mm, 
frozen yogurt. Like, why does that sound good? And I haven't even ate any real food since breakfast. I'm not gonna do that to myself. This place is like really cute. It's like, I don't know what, I don't even know what area I'm in. Uh, Madison Avenue Salon Suites and Spas. That's where I got my hair done. But I don't know what this is. It looks like a little shopping center. It's cute though. Um, it's a little vibe or whatever. By the way, I have on Skims and Yeezys. Um, like every other fucking influencer in the world on YouTube and Instagram. Yeah, I need some food. I was supposed to go get my nails done and this hair appointment took longer than I anticipated. So I missed my nail appointment. So I'm gonna have to move it till tomorrow because I'm not leaving for there to go on the plane until 11. So I have time in the morning to go get my nails done at nine. It's only take like an hour and a half. I just have to make sure I have all my shit packed. What else is over here? There's an Escalante Mexican restaurant. You know what I'm tired of? I'm tired of Tex-Mex. Tired of the Mexican food in Texas. This shit sucks. Mexican food on the West Coast is just, I don't know, it's way different. Like the Mexican food I've had in Washington and California, that's my type of vibe. Mexican food here, gentrified. That, that, that's, that's exactly what Tex-Mex is. Gentrified Mexican food. Ooh, there's an ice cream place. Mm. I love me some sweets, girl. I'm just walking. There's hella restaurants over here. I'm just gonna see what I find. Yeah. So, let me get some food. And um, after that, I'm gonna go to the mall and see what I can try to get last minute at Zara. Because I don't really have any, like, Vegas clothes. Like, I, feel like, I don't know. Vegas, you gotta pop out. It's, like, fun. It's, like, fun. And I don't have no fun clothes in my closet. It's all like neutral and I'm trying to like jazz it up, you know? So I'm about to depend on Zara to come through for your girl. We're going to see. So she's back. I know. I know. I said I was going to take you guys to the mall with me, but I went into Zara and I was there for maybe like 10 minutes and I didn't see anything. So that's cool. I don't have nothing to wear. Yeah. Yeah. Like, bro. So annoying. Whatever. I'm gonna try to put something together that's giving a look. Like, I at least want one for a picture, you know what I mean, on Instagram. Everything else is probably just gonna be so far because I didn't have any time to really prep for it, whatever. So I didn't get anything from Zara, um, but I did get a new perfume. This is by Brito, by Rito. Girl, I don't know how to pronounce this. I really don't. And I was actually on live last week, and um, one of you guys were like, oh, I think her name's Maria. Hey girl, I swear it's Maria. Let me, hold on, I don't wanna be disrespectful. Let me make sure her name is Maria, because she always shows love, hold on. Oh, uh, Marina, Marina, Marina. Hey girl, if you've made it far to the segment. She had, um, suggested a perfume while I was on live and it was by this brand and I was like oh I don't recognize this brand but I do because I've seen the bottle numerous times I just never knew what it was called or anything and I she's um suggested let me see what scent she had suggested and if it was the one that I had got because I screenshotted it uh b-a-l-d-e-f-r-i-q-u-e bald freak I don't know if I smelled that one I don't know if I smelled it, I didn't like it that much because I didn't get it. I don't know if I smelled that one, girl. Um, I was in a rush at the mall too because I had to go get my lashes done, which I got done. I got hybrid. Um, I'll link where I got them done by down below. They look really good. I'm just kind of, I was getting used to not having lashes because I didn't have lashes for like a month and I was kind of like feeling the vibe. But now that I have them again, I don't know. You just have to get used to it. It's like when you don't have makeup on, it just looks like literally just like a black shadow almost like above your eyelids but then when you have makeup on you like appreciate it more i don't know i just have to get used to it back to the perfume um i got Mo i don't know how to pronounce this mojave 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 ghost um i got the 1.6 fluid ounce this I sprayed it on in the store and I can still smell it. And this was like four hours ago. Like I understand why it's so expensive. 
It smells so good. Um, I like sweeter scents, so I asked him specifically for sweeter scents. He pointed me to this. He pointed me to Mixed Feelings, which smelled disgusting. I'm like, where did you get sweet from? And then there was one other one, but I really wasn't feeling it that much. But this is kind of, it smells, I'm so bad at like talking about perfumes and what the fuck they smell like. Girl, I just be saying it smells good and sweet. Sweet, musky, and oh my God, I don't know. If you guys are in a store that sells this brand, go smell it and tell me if you like it because this is my new favorite scent that I have. And I've seen that uh, Sundays was like really, really popular. Like I've seen a lot of people have that and I smelt it, did not like it. I was like, no, this is not, not for me. But kind of update on my hair. Clearly the curls fell, um, but it's not frizzy whatsoever. It's still really laid. Um, you could still clearly see the layers and it's like, they're still body. And I'm, I, I love it. Like, I literally love it. This is what it looks like in the back. So I just have to restyle it. I'm not gonna restyle it till tomorrow until I'm actually going out and doing something. My whole day was taken up by women hygiene and fucking upkeep. Like, I'm, it, it makes me so mad how much stuff we have to do because I don't enjoy doing it. Like. I want it done, like snap my fingers and it done, but I hate the process. I got up this morning, I went to the gym, then I went to go get my hair done. That took like three hours. Then I went to the mall, then I went to go get my lashes done, then I went to go get a wax. And now it's eight o'clock. Like my whole day is gone. And all men have to do is get a haircut. And a manicure and pedicure if they're, you know, if they do that, like, that's it. Anywho. Right now, I need to start packing. Yeah, I don't really know what I'm gonna pack, but we're gonna figure it out because I have to wear something, you know? I can't just be walking around butt naked. I kinda have an idea of like what I wanna wear. Clearly, I'm gonna be at a pool. And I have this outfit from Cell that I've had for like, I don't even know, maybe six months, literally. Longer than that, I purchased this before I moved to Houston, so maybe almost a year, I'm not even kidding. And I haven't worn it because I just felt like the only appropriate place to wear this was like Miami or Vegas. Somewhere that's like, I don't know, it wasn't giving me tropical vibes. So it's a bikini, it's a three piece. The top is really not that flattering because it's an underwire and when you have small boobs, you need like triangle tops. It flatters you the best. So. With this, it kind of requires cleavage, and I don't know. It doesn't, it's not that flattering to me, but anyways, I want to wear it, and I don't have any accessories to go with it. I wanted some, like, retro-y sunglasses, um, so, like, I'll show you guys what the vibes I'm talking about. I wanted some sunglasses like the these. So these are from Desi. Do you see, I don't know, like the shape of them is so cute and it will go so good with this if it was like at least white and gold, preferably pink, cause I wanted to do like monochromatic. So I don't have any sunglasses to go with it. I'm still gonna bring it, but we'll see what I can do with her. And I was gonna wear it with these orange heels right here because X mixed with orange um, and see how that is. So I'm gonna bring her. I have my suitcase down here. So I'm literally just gonna be packing with you guys. And then I have this, oops. This is also from Cell Bikini that I got like maybe three years ago, two years ago. Um, this was like one of her first not me trying this on, girl. This was one of her, like, first drops. Do you see? It even, like, lifted my titties while... Mm -mm. <laughs> Anyways, this kind of gives me fun Vegas vibes. The snakeskin. We'll see what I can do with her. She has nude. So I was thinking about wearing it with my Desi early 2000s. I don't know if that's going to look good. Oh, wait, 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 wait. She might be a look. She might be a look. She might be a look. Hold on. She might be a look. Not me trying to shake my hair, girl, like I got 20 inches on my head. Whoa. Okay, wait, 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 wait,
Okay, 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 okay. I think she might be a look too. Period. I'm only gonna be there from Thursday. I get there like midday Thursday, and then I'm leaving Sunday morning. So, yeah, I think two bikinis. I'll bring another one just in case. I'll bring this one if I want to tan or something. I got it from um, Victoria's Secret. Girl, I got this when I was in high school. But it's still cute. It's a mesh white bikini. It's just very simple. I hate the bottoms because they kind of give me diaper vibes. But I was also in high school, so I wasn't trying to be that you know, revealing, I guess, but yeah. Okay, so baby suits out the way and I need outfits to walk in. So I'm gonna bring this two piece from Snood. It's, my, it's like my green one, you guys have asked about it before. I'm gonna bring this romper too that you guys have seen me wear from Zara. I'm gonna bring her to walk around in as well. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, I forgot I had this. Okay, wait, 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 wait. So I bought this dress from Sublime. And it's just a backless dress. Um, it's similar to the one I wore in Cabo. That's green. This one right here, it's literally like the same style. But I got an extra small because my boobs, I don't have any boobies. But then it's super tight on my butt. Whatever, I'm still gonna bring it. But I need, I don't have any, I don't have any heels to go with it though. So this is my whole thing. I got this, but I don't got it. I got this, but I don't got it. Whatever, I'm gonna bring her. I'm selling it, so if you guys are interested, it's in my Depop. My Depop is the same as my Instagram name, which is M-O-S-M-X-O. -S if you guys are ever interested, yeah. Um, I think I said interested five times and I have this as well that I forgot about too So I bought this from Ruv R-E-V-E shop. It's a two-piece With these pants And it's fire it goes crazy it makes my body go crazy So I'm definitely gonna wear this on like a night out. I'm thinking it has to be at night because this is knit <laughs> I will literally die. And I was going to wear her with my Jacquemus purse, my white one, and some nude heels. Or this one. Yeah, I'm going to wear her in nude heels. I think that would be really cute. I was going to wear these heels, but he's nude because it had like the knit and I thought it would go nice. But this, for one, is raggedy. I don't even know why I still have these. And it's not, it's just like, it's throwing the vibes off because it's literally not the same nude. So I think I'm going to wear these because this is the same exact nude. Hopefully I get at least like one solid picture where I'm like eating the girlies up. You know? I'm going to bring this dress that I got from Lily Silk. Damn, I need to wax my armpits today. God. Okay. What other dress am I going to bring? I'm going to bring this dress too. That I got from Boohoo mad long ago. It's a, uh, it's just a black mat. This dress is actually really, really nice. It's just a black mesh dress, and it has like a cutout. It's so classy, so sexy. I'm gonna bring her, and I'll probably wear those two dresses with my black heels. Y'all know from Aldo. All right, well, that's all I really have in me to. Uh, <laughs> A symbol. I'm not gonna be there for long, so I'm sure I'll put something together. I'm thinking of doing a get ready with me in Vegas. I'm gonna vlog a little bit. Um, y'all know. I don't know. My vacations. I just like it to be vacation, and I just it feels too too much like an obligation to try to film while I'm also trying to have relief from work. If that makes sense. But I'm gonna finish packing and wrap up the night so i will show you guys my packing and then i'll see you guys in the morning yeah hey y'all happy what is thursday we're going to vegas today i know last night i was like yeah i'm gonna show you guys me packing i was gonna do a little speed up da, da, da. i didn't even pack last night i threw those clothes in that suitcase and i was like yeah i'm gonna do this tomorrow <laughs> 
period so my lashes i like my lashes today because a couple of them fell out you know like day one two or not day one but like day two three they look a little better because they're not as like but you have to get them kind of like really full at first because otherwise in five days you won't have no damn lashes um so let me show you guys what i am wearing hold on i don't feel like getting my tripod out of my freaking um what is it called my bag okay so i'm wearing this girl not my box this fit is from zara they're sweats if you guys don't like collective hold then you know and then i have a black like crop top on but it's also the same material as, as the sweats and i'm gonna wear my desi sunnies cool 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 and then um i'm gonna wear my black easy 450s you guys have seen them numerous times so yeah that's what we're those are the vibes i love these sunglasses like i need to invest in more sunglasses honestly because in seattle it was barely sunny so i didn't have that many they here, sorry it's dark y'all, I'm in my closet, putting my stuff away. Um, Houston, girl, it's sunny like almost all year round. And people be wearing sunglasses here in the winter. So, I'm not used to that, but I like it. I don't mind it though. <laughs> you feel me? And I think I have everything. I'm just making sure I'm not forgetting nothing. Like last minute, I'm taking the last little look around. Mm -hmm. Yep, we good. We on. Ain't no but a little bit scraping. Anyways, I will see you guys when I'm flying out, baby. I forgot to show you guys my nails. I went to go get my nails done this morning. I never vlog my nails because I'm getting my hands and my feet done at the same time. Like, how you think I'm maneuvering the camera now? So I'm obsessed. I'm up, 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 up. obsessed. Okay, look, look how pretty so i get dip and i decided to go with like a very neutral light pink underneath with a thin friendship and my toes are the same girl listen i'm about to get this for the next six months like you're gonna have to tear me away from this french tip because i found it like i found my signature i feel like i found my signature the shape the, just the, girl the length the everything. the everything so yeah anyways now we can go Bye bye so I just got done getting ready. I'm going to dinner. I didn't do much after I checked into the room. So that's why I didn't vlog. But I'm sure you guys were wearing, I don't know, my hair, it turned out like really curly and I wasn't anticipating that. I guess because my hair is healthier now, it takes heat better and the layers make it look even more curled. So I'm like waiting for them to fall. There's no humidity here, which is like great, but I kind of wanted to fall a little bit because it's like it's giving me Shirley Temple <laughs> and that's not what I want to get. So I'm wearing this. Where is it like on my dress? It's my deodorant. I'm wearing this black dress. Excuse the mess in the back. I'm like rushing to get ready. Um, it's from Boohoo. If you guys watched one of my weekly vlogs from a long, long time ago, you guys would have seen this. It's just like a mesh dress with cutouts. So cute. And then my Aldo heels, you know, my faves. And yeah, we're just doing it very simple. Bitch, you calling me? Hold on. Okay, front desk. Anyways, yeah, better go to dinner. So I don't know if I'm gonna film. Whoa, we'll, we'll fucking see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Y'all know I'm bad at filming on vacation, girl. I'm trying to fucking have a vacation, okay? Hey, y'all. It's the next day. What's today? Girl, uh, it's Friday. Um, yeah, this is the vibes. Today, we're underneath this because, yeah, it's 100 degrees out here. And I am at the pool right now. Let me show you. It's cute. It's the Venetian. She's a very cute. Whatever. There she is. Hotel. Hotel. But I have on this cell bikini. Thought she was, you guys saw me pack this. Very big appropriate. And then I have my Desi 2000s on. But I just been tanning. I just been out here for like three, four hours. Just chilling, drinking, 
Um, I've been drinking pina coladas. I guess those are my new ting. But it melts so damn fast. I didn't even finish this one, look. That's tragic. Look how much sugar is in that. That just, ugh, whatever. I'm on vacation, girl. Do not be calorie counting when I'm on vacation. Anyways, but yeah, I'm just chilling. I'm gonna go walk the strip after this. And I kind of got dark. I'm, in, I'm trying to get dark, baby, okay? Because the heat here is so much better than it is in um, Houston. It's dry heat. So even though it's like 100 degrees, I'm not like overbearingly hot. I'm not sweating. I'm not, like it's bearable, you know? I'm, I don't know how much of this trip I'm going to vlog, honestly. I'll probably vlog a little bit when I'm on the strip. And then that's it, girl. That's all I'm going to do. Because I didn't even really want to vlog. Anyway, I was like, let me get some, the girls some content. You feel me? I ended up going to, uh, last night, where did I go? Cut? I think it's called Cut, or Colt. One of those. Um, it's in the Palazzo. Or in, no, it's in the Venetian. The Palazzo and Venetian are connected. So it's, I think it's in between them. That's where I ended up going to dinner last night. It was so good. Yeah, look at my skin. She has some dark marks, but like, what? Period. Okay, speaking of that, I don't know if this is TMI, but we're gonna say it anyways. Um, my cycle ended yesterday, the day I flew out. I was so, so happy. I was like, yes. Cause girl, being on that time of the month, while like you have a bathing suit on, going swimming, and being on vacation, it's literally like taking care of yourself. Like putting a fucking diaper on, that's what it feels like to me. Oh, I got this too. Let me see, let me see, let me show you guys, hold on. So I forgot my browning lotion at home, the sun bum, and then I got this instead from Walgreens the uh, tanning oil. This is great because it gives you that sheen. The browning lotion, I feel like gets me hella tan. Cause when I was in Mexico, girl, I got tan tan. But yeah, I'm just gonna spray some of this on me. So I can get fucking dark and be another skin tone. Yeah. I really need to tan my backside, I'm tripping. My lips dry as hell. That's the thing about this too, like, Houston, there's so much moisture in the air that your lips, your skin stays moisturize here the girl I'm like every five seconds but anywho I will probably just check in with you guys after I'm done at the pool and I'm like walking around at the strip yeah see you soon